Jason Kelly. Earlier this month, I was tasked with demonstrating just what our campus has to offer. And admittedly before making this, I had no clue we even offered this many clubs, which I think is a great example of why this video needed to be made. Now, whether you are new to campus or you are like me and you just didn't know that we had this much to offer, I guarantee you North has one of the most diverse club campuses in the county and there is a club for you. They would love for you to join, whether you reach out to join or you work and be invited to an honor society or an advanced after school team. Now, with that all out of the way, because this has taken quite a bit to make, I think we should go look at them. I'm Melissa Diaz, and I'm the 2021-2022 SGA Council President. SGA ensures the student body has a voice. We are the main communicators between the student body and administration, and we plan nearly all the events that go on around campus. You have the opportunity to run for an officer position to have more of a voice and to make more decisions, but if that's not your thing and you don't really want to be an officer or you just don't want to put yourself out there, you can still be a part of the club as a member. Uh, to become a member, you just have to show up to any of the meetings, preferably the first one, and then you get all the like beginning of the year information and uh, pay your dues and you're right in the club. This ensures that you have a voice when anything's going on and to make sure that you're in the loop. And if you have a say and any ideas or just anything you want to see happen, you just show up to one of the meetings. Hi, my name is Brooke Williamson and I'm the president of National Honor Society. Some of the things we do in National Honor Society are we work a lot with elementary schools, we do a lot of community outreach projects. One of the things we're doing right now is we're creating shoe boxes full of goods to send off to people all across the world so that they, for children, so that they can have a really nice Christmas. And some of the things that you need to do to join are you can't just join just in any time. You actually, there are, there's a certain set of criteria that you have to have. So NHS is a national organization that is set on four pillars of excellence. So the pillars are scholarship, leadership, service, and um, character. So to be able to join, um, it's just going to be juniors for this year, and juniors will be sent out an invitation if you have a GPA of an unweighted 3.5. So if you have that GPA, if you meet that requirement, then you will be sent an invitation where you will have an application. And then those people will be given the opportunity to fill out the application where you'll write about your service or your volunteer opportunities that you do in and out of school. You'll get to talk about your grades. You also get to talk about your activities and your leadership opportunities in those activities. And then there are also teacher recommendations where your teachers will talk about your character in and out of the classroom. And we're really excited to have anyone new who's going to join National Honor Society. It's just a really good way to get involved in your school and your community. Hi there, my name is Mr. Maldonado. I'm one of the sponsors for National Art Honor Society along with Mrs. Holly Kurth. Um, National Art Honor Society is a service-based uh, organization that holds art students in particular to a, a higher standard of professionalism, of leadership, and community work within their own physical communities or around the nation. Um, it is a nationally organized or recognized organization, generally by um, by invite only, so usually between 10th and 12th grade, if you'll receive an invitation from us and it'll be your decision on whether you'd like to join the organization. Uh, it's a great resume line for universities um, that, that look for things like that, especially for anyone wanting to get into the arts field. Um, and it's just a, a great way to, to meet people and a great way to experience the, the artistic world from a different line of life. Hi, my name is Katie Blackwell and I'm president of Molly Wen. Um, so Maori UN is a simulation of the United Nations and we come together in a conference and we just talk about world issues and come up with resolutions on how to solve them. Um, you can join by, jo by joining our Google Classroom and our meetings are every other Thursday. Hi, my name is Emily Vigil and I'm the Vice President of the Youth and Government Club. Personally, I love this club because I like to write a bill in the legislative branch of Youth and Government and I want to be a lawyer when I grow up. Well, anyways, this club is run by the YMCA, and it's also a student-led program. This student-led program allows students to experience the legislative, judicial, and executive branch, the three branches of government. And you can write a bill and then go all the way to states in Tallahassee. So I think it's really fun, and I'll see you there. So hello, my name is Alyssa Bernhardt. I'm president of Environmental Club. The purpose of Environmental is to work to combat climate change within a timely manner. You can join by attending our meetings, which are on the first Monday of every month. Um, my name is Alexis. I'm a member of the Paws and Claws Club, and our club basically consists of raising money for 
animal shelters so they can have supplies for the winter. Um, how you can join is go to Miss Skinner's classroom and she will give you a Google Classroom code and that's how you join. Hi, my name is Grace Harvey and I'm president of United Club. Basically the overall uh, purpose of this club is to unite um, the ESC and general ed students. What we do is we have little parties with them, we do fun crafts, DIYs, cooking, and we also play Just Dance. Um, if you would like to join this club, just attend our meetings every Thursday in, e in room E132. Hi, I'm Lucia Westgate. I am Key Club's treasurer. Key Club is a global organization. In fact, it's the biggest student-led global organization um, sponsored by Kiwanis. And we do service projects and we help the community all over. Um, a way to join is we have meetings the last Wednesday or close to the last Wednesday of every month. And you can just come and we usually have some sort of service project that you can get from it. It's a great way to earn service hours and a great way to meet people. Hello, my name is Benjamin Johnson. I'm currently the active president, one of the founding members of REA or Riddick. You might have seen a couple of our posters around the school and wondered what we're about. Well, similar to things like Key Club and student government, we try to give our members a way to both mature their own skills as well as helping out in the community. Personally, my favorite part is the fact that when you join REA, not only can you help yourself grow, but you can help others grow around you. We are active in a multitude of different volunteer efforts to help different communities around the school and around the greater Fort Myers Cape Coral area. If you wish to join, uh, the best option would be to contact Mr. Ashby directly or call one of the uh, notes from some of the posters we have around the school. We'll be glad to have you and hope to see you soon. Hi, my name is Delaney Supa. Lead Like a Woman Club is a club, it's a very safe space, it harbors inclusivity and equality and we do community service for the environment, for the community. So um, if you want to join, you can just reach out to anyone that's in the club or anyone that knows the classroom code. Hello, my name is Tallulah Makita. I'm Vice President of the North Fort Myers High School Pride Club. Our Pride Club was created to be a safe space for people who identify with the LGBTQ plus community and to have a place where people could converse with other people in the community. At our weekly meetings, we talk about uh, LGBTQ plus history, pop culture, as well as any policy issues which might be going on in the world at the time. To join, you just have to be open-minded and uh, with your peers and just show up. We have meetings in Mr. Andosha's room after school until 2.30. My name is Parker Johnson. I was a former Raiders member, and on Raiders we practice teamwork, uh, leadership, and physical discipline. Oh, uh, you join uh, by trying out out at the Raiders gate or talking to uh, Sergeant Major Morris or uh, Sergeant Clough in the JROTC building. Hi, I'm Megan Taparachi and I do marksmanship for JROTC and there we learn how to team build and you learn how to work well with a lot of people and you get to set up the targets, go to shooting competitions and there are some scholarship opportunities that are there and with shooting it comes with a lot of safety rules and to join you would have to take our safety required test and we would meet on Tuesdays and Thursdays in the cafeteria after school. Hi, my name is Melanie. I'm a member of the drill team and we have color guard, exhibition, and marching. And what we do is, uh, for color guard, we do special events like graduations and football games. And for everything else, we just do competitions and stuff. And it's also really fun, so yeah. So what you have to do to join is just show up to practices Monday, Wednesdays, and Tuesdays. See you there. Hi, I'm Brianna Bright and I'm a member of the North Fort Myers High School Dance Team. We work to help promote school spirit and it is an audition-based club, so we look for experienced dancers. In Dance Team, we meet once a week to choreograph and work on the dances to perform at pep rallies. The sponsor for Dance Team is the dance teacher here at North Fort Myers, Amy Valerius. My name is Mrs. Haas. I'm the coach for Unified Bowling at North Fort Myers High School. If you are interested in joining, you may come see me in room E140. We are a competitive bowling team within the district, and then when we win, we go on to a state level. So if you are interested in being a partner with students of the ESE population, we would love to have you join us in room E140 so that you can be a part of the Unified Bowling team. Thank you. My name is Alex Leeds. I'm the president of the theater program here at North. 
Uh, here in the theater program, we do a couple of things. We work on performances and embedding as a performer, sing, acting and dancing wise. Uh, we also have a couple of competitions, including districts as we just did, where most of our performers got to peers. Um, if you want to join the theater program, you can always talk to Miss Lodge. We can set up audition times, or and you can be part of our shows. Uh, we're doing something rotten coming up here soon, and we'd be happy to see you there. Hi, my name is Delaney. I'm a part of Technology Student Association, or TSA. TSA is, is really the investment of your time and your money, and it, there's a bunch of requirements. You have to fill out consent forms, and there are competitions you have to go to, so you have to ensure that you can go to those competitions. However, when it comes to those competitions, here at TSA you can utilize like almost every resource you need for your competition. We have categories all throughout STEM, such as um, digital video production and video game making. Hi there, my name is Mr. Maldonado. I am the sponsor for the Ceramics Club. Um, generally, the club is open to just about anybody. Um, the, the purpose of the club is to give students an opportunity who maybe aren't enrolled in the course or who have taken the course before or don't have the, the time frame to take the course, the ability to come in and work at their leisure um, and work with their peers. It, you know, it's pretty much open to anyone, no matter if you have very little experience, no experience. Um, you're an expert at it, so anyone can physically join the club. It's usually Monday through Thursdays um, till three o'clock, um, and if you're if you're wanting to learn a specific trait, um, usually we can set you up with a student in one of the upper level courses who can generally help out with that. Hi, I'm Ellie Zink. I'm currently a member of North's Medical Club. It's run by Miss Hill in room 204. In Medical Club, we take science and medicine and we put it together. In this club, we typically go through a current issue or something to think about, like smoking or vaping, and we think, how can we fix this? And then we typically go through a fundraiser, and normally, in a normal school year, we have medical club once or twice a month. With COVID, it's sort of postponed, but if you have any questions, make sure to contact Ms. Hill, room 204. Hello, my name is Alyssa Bernhardt, and I am the co-vice president of Creativity for a Cause. Creativity for a Cause is a volunteer club where we make crafts, and all of the proceeds go to Valisano Children's Hospital. You can earn volunteer hours by participating, and you can join by meeting every first Friday of the month in E105, and follow our Instagram, and join our Google Classroom. Hi, I'm Megan, and I'm the junior editor of the North Fort Myers High School Yearbook. In this class, we take pictures of all the sporting events, everything that happens during school, homecoming, any event you could think of. We get sports passes, press passes to get them for free, and we get to catch the student life in its rarest form. We get to design pages and create layouts and talk about what goes on, what's happened this season, and all the accomplishments. Um, you can join by contacting your counselor and asking to fill out a request form to get into your book and it'll go through Mrs. Kerr, the teacher, and you might get accepted and then you are in the class for the eighth period.